the nation's waistline bulging, food manufacturers like Cadbury face a problem. New government guidelines mean they're now under pressure to provide reduced sugar products. For Cadbury, the challenge is huge. The vast majority of its chocolate bars are more than 50% sugar. The man entrusted with solving Cadbury's sugar problem is chocolate scientist Adam Harris. Just hold on to the handrails when you're coming up, guys. In the Bourneville factory's experimental pilot plant, he's working on a hush-hush project to make a version of dairy milk which is 30% less sugar. We're now going to put some ingredients in here that are top secret. Unfortunately, you can't look inside the buckets because that's where the secret lies. He's meddled for two years for the sacred recipe and thinks he's conjured a solution. Replacing sugar with fibre. With a launch date looming, Adam's new recipe is now ready to go into its final testing phase. We're working on something massive that is very, very new for the chocolate world. This is by far one of the most difficult things I've ever had to deliver in my career. You know, you've got um, a brand that people are religious about. You know, until people are buying this in the marketplace, I'm going to be worrying about it. There's just one more ingredient to add to his secret formula. This is beautiful cocoa butter. A couple of gallons of pure fat. <laughs> While Adam's team cook up a 30% less sugar prototype, other Oompa Loompas have been given nearly £5 million to put Cadbury products under the microscope and feed them into computers. In one lab, a researcher samples chocolate and breathes out chalky fumes into a state-of-the-art machine capable of measuring what she's tasting. When you chew into a product in your mouth, you sense it through your nose. This machine actually, you know, you can breathe into it and it tracks what you're uh, perceiving in your mouth. Upstairs is the department of mouthfeel, where Dr. Chi Hei masticates for a living. So the average uh, consumer uh, chewing times around 20 seconds. Dr. Hei has a PhD in the science of chewing. Only by seeing how the globules of fat, sugar and cocoa arrange themselves on his slide can Dr. Hay unlock the secret to the perfect mouthfeel that will make Cadbury products irresistible. Try some new. Nice snap. That's good. That's good mouthfeel. That's all you want, someone to say that's good. It's good, isn't it? It's good. <laughs> it's not just Adam's colleagues who are enjoying the finished article. In the labs, the computerised tasting machine is also rather enjoying his new bar. So, 30% less, and this is the standard dairy milk. The profiles are consistent, so we've definitely managed to retain the signature flavour that you would expect. We think we've got the perfect profile now. Good free indulgence.